Welcome to Goodwe Training Series. Today we will guide you through the unboxing and installation process of the MSUS. Step 1. Unboxing. Let's take a look at the MSUS box. Inside the box, there is a mounting template, a mounting plate, an accessory box and the inverter. In the accessory box, you can find the following components. Then let's have a look at the appearance of MSUS from different views. Length is 670 mm, width is 487 mm and height is 199 mm. Here is the Goodwe logo and four indicators. Here is the parameter label of the inverter. Here is the DC switch. On the bottom view of the inverter, you'll see a variety of ports. Step 2. Installation of inverter. Before the installation, we need to make sure the DC switch is turned off and the installer need to wear the insulated gloves. Put the mounting template on the wall horizontally and mark positions for drilling holes. Secure the mounting plate to the wall with appropriate fasteners. Next, hang the inverter on the mounting bracket. Install the safety screw to secure the inverter to the mounting plate. Secure the lower attachment point with two screws. Step 3. PV Side Wiring. Remove the four screws of the wiring compartment cover. Open the case. Then let's start with the preparation of the PV wiring. Unscrew the PV port at the bottom of the inverter and screw the metal pipe. Use a wire stripper to strip the insulation layer to a suitable length. Next, insert the wire into the metal crimp contacts and crimp it tightly with crimping pliers. Insert the wires into the positive DC connector and fasten the connector. Repeat the same process for the negative DC connector. Then, connect each PV wire to the PV terminals. Step 4. AC Side Wiring Strip the AC wire insulation sheet of L, N, and PE of a suitable length with a wire stripper. Then pull out the wires. Connect the AC cables to the corresponding connection port, L1, L2, and neutral. Finally, install the PE wire to the grounding busbar tightly. Step 5. Connect Smart Meter. Unscrew the meter port at the bottom of the inverter and screw the metal pipe. Then pull out the wires. Strip the insulation layer to a suitable length and insert the wire into the communication terminal. Screw tightly. Then insert the terminal into the connector by hearing a click sound. Connect the other side of wire to the meter and do not forget to power the meter. GWRSD is only for Goodwe Rapid Shutdown device. RSD is already integrated in MSUS Inverter. Before using the RSD function, it is necessary to connect these two ports to power the RSD. You can use the included 2-pin terminal in accessory box. Step 6. Install the cover plate. Install the cover plate, tighten the screw. Then install the antenna. Now you can turn on the inverter. Step 7. Configuration via SolarGo. Download SolarGo app and turn on the phone Bluetooth. Open the SolarGo app. Refresh the home page and you will see the connected SN code. Select the device and use password 1234 to connect the inverter with an installer account. On the home page and parameters page, you will find basic data about the inverter. Before configuring the inverter, do not forget to configure Wi-Fi to ensure the inverter is connected to the network. In the Basic Settings, choose the safety code. Enter the password, Goodwe2010. You can select the safety code based on your country or region. Don't forget to save the settings before exiting. Finally, click Advanced Setting, AFCI Test. Confirm that you have turned on the AFCI function. That concludes the MSUS unboxing and installation guide. Thank you for watching. For more installation and configuration videos of Goodwe training series, please visit our Goodwe community and stay tuned to our official account.